Pickers, how you doing? Let's do another pick a card and today is going to be what do they want to tell you? We have three decks at the moment. Uh, we have an, the latest one, this one, uh, which is absolutely gorgeous. Um, I'm slightly obsessed with this. Uh, but we also have uh, the normal one, the soul cards, of course, with Major Arcana, but we have this little beauty. Okay, so now I presented all <laughs> decks to introduce you. <laughs> Let's get on with it, okay? So, okay, what am I doing? What am I doing? It's been a long day already, so let's go. Okay, so one, two, one, two. Part number one, what do they want to tell you? The star, Whew. temperance, queen of wands, holy mother of God. So, of course, they want to tell you that you are the light at the end of the tunnel. You are the inspiration. You give a lot of answers to the question. You bring them a certain level of peace and balance. As you can see, those two jars of water, which is all about emotion. There's an idea as well of rebalancing again. You know, you can see those two jars again. So there's an idea that you meant to be together and together you work just fine. You are balancing each other. And, you know, it's about being guided by the universe to reconnect, okay? For me, at first, it could have been an attraction. Male, female, doesn't matter. They see you very luminous, very sexy. Yeah, they want to tell you, of course, I had love at first sight or some kind of a massive, uh, you know, addiction to you, your beauty and attraction. Of course, the chemistry is massive, but it's so much more. It's all about emotion. So, woof, it's a lot to take in. So let's have more information, all right? So, yeah, they learn and they, they learn about themselves. They learn to redefine themselves, but they also believe that you're meant to be together. Again, you know, the temperance card and the year of fun and major arcana saying that the universe wants you together because you work really well together and you teaching each other the massive lessons that you need to understand <laughs> understand uh, at the end of the day what they want to tell you is they want to choose you they may have been with someone else at the time and so they realize no it's not what i want what i want is true love and they chose you they choose love maybe also it was a mindset that was uh, their mindset and very limited when you uh, allow them to be limitless amazing okay so woo, limitless you think so the best kind of the old deck you are the inner child for them that's what they want to tell you i feel safe with you i feel at home with you i can see you know having children with you or maybe there were children involved because they were with another relationship and that's for therefore they just mm, they had to work it out of course you know, when you have children, you have responsibilities, absolutely. But they cannot deny what you represent for them. You are the, the yin and the yang. You, you can be goofy, you can be uh, tranquil, you can be at peace, you can be whatever. Together, it makes sense. You see what I'm saying? So let's have some major arcana because I think it's, it's quite uh, intense. You know, so what they want to tell you is that I see you. I know who you are. I recognize you. Okay, so that is not a little message. It's massive judgment. Yeah, they have to purge the situation, either because they are they were with someone else, or they had a mindset that was very limited, and they cannot afford to be limited. They need to open up to the limitless, as we were saying. Okay, so that's massive. Okay, so let's have a, a look at those beautiful cards, the healing angel cards okay so you have the reference of all those decks uh down below in the description box okay so let's have a look it's a little message to help you just to have a positive thinking <laughs> just have a, another idea positive thinking is vital in creating a healthy and abundant life a positive attitude along with positive belief and thought are crucial ingredient for creating happiness don't worry think love you see what I'm saying? If that is not creating love here, I don't know what we're talking about here. Mm -hmm. So that's what they want to tell you. Beautiful. Okay, so uh, it's quite massive. Pal number two, what do they want to tell you? The moon, queen of cups, nine of pentacles. What they want to tell you is you're an example. You um, showing in leading by example. Um, you open your heart, you did an introspection, you work a lot on yourself. You don't need to scream and shout about it. You just do it, okay? And they understand you've been through a lot in your life. And despite all of that, you kept an open heart, very fresh in your heart, very um, 
very good person. You want to do some good in this world. Beautiful. So that pushes them to do an introspection. Where am I standing? Who am I? Do I know where I'm going? I don't have a clue. I haven't sorted myself out. I haven't done the homework. I just need to wake up. I've been suppressing a lot of things. A lot of things they didn't want to confront. They have to confront it because they need to have the yin and the yang with you. The thing is very romantic, but also maybe too romantic for them. They couldn't handle it. Okay. They didn't have the savoir faire. Now, they may have covered their heart. It could be yourself as well because you're like, well, you know, until you do your homework, don't, don't come here near me, right? But that could be themselves. You know, there's no gender, male, female, doesn't matter. They're covering them, their heart. They didn't want to go deep. They didn't want to do that introspection. And that, of course, is scary. Of course it is. You know, once you open that gate, it's massive, okay? So we need to, yeah, we have some homework to do and it's very painful. They had to understand I need to go back to a place where it hurt, you know, like my childhood trauma. I need to revisit that, not to dwell on it, but to just release it. You know, the thing is, all those things that was the hidden part of the iceberg, underwater, you couldn't see, they have to come up to be released, okay? You cannot build up like a pressure cook that is very unhealthy, very unhealthy. Then you can actually equally give to each other absolute and receive each other absolutely beautiful but you need to have the homework done so then you balance you know how much you can give you know how much you can trust you don't have a trust issue blah 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 right absolutely let's have more cards yeah there is a regret because they knew they had a potential with you they had to reconcile but they have to reconcile themselves with themselves to, to start with they cannot be uh, lovable to anyone if they don't love themselves enough to do the homework they have to really sort out the garden within and then they can actually expand the garden but it's, it has to start from within inevitably okay so yeah you see the empress you are really four queens who doesn't matter male female doesn't matter you are someone very together you are home for them you are grounded, you can be very strong, you have a clear idea of boundaries, you know what you're made of, you can be tender at times, you can be powerful at times, you can be sexy at times, you can be all of the above. So be it. You don't have to be one dimensional, you can be multi dimensional and the more the merrier. Mm -hmm. So that's what they, they want to tell you. They see you as that, but they have to catch with you, catch up with you catch with you they want to catch up with you at the same level so let's have a major arcana from the soul cards because we like them don't we yes we do so what do they want to tell you the fool yeah they have to take that leap of faith but they have to take that leap of faith within themselves first they need to open the heart go out there and then then it makes sense correct yes so let's have a healing angel cards just to have an extra information for you an extra message for pal number two what do they want to tell you Gratitude. Make gratitude your new attitude. The stars will shine brighter upon you. All in this world will become lighter. Exactly. You have to start from within. You have to do that work within yourself. And then you can, you know, really take off. But it has to come within. And that's the message here. So on this note, have a beautiful day. And I'll see you tomorrow. Mwah. Ciao.